Hello. Uh, thank you uh, for your for the introduction. Um, I would like also to welcome you at the new premises of the National Library of Greece, uh, here at the Stavros Niarchos Foundation Cultural Center, and to thank you for the kind invitation to participate in this event. Okay. Uh, before we begin, I would like uh, to present you some data uh, regarding the book market in Greece. Since there are no bibliographic databases to monitor systematically the Greek publishing market, in order to compile a reliable list of Greek e-books, the data presented were collected by the ISBN office and catalogs from electronic, electronic bookstores. Uh, as one might observe, 138 from a total number of 927 uh, active Greek publishers produce ebooks. Only 20 of them have published more than 20 electronic titles, and the number uh, of uh, ebooks is approximately 8,000 titles, and mostly in the field of literature. Uh, these are the data collected in 2017. And uh, this is uh, because since then uh, not much has changed. This uh, happens for many reasons and mainly because of the mentality of the Greek publishers, the insecurity uh, regarding the e-book piracy or even the margin of profit based on the Greek reality of e-book market. The Reading Room is an electronic reading platform that provides free access to Greek popular uh, electronic books uh, remotely for a limited time to all NLG registered users. Uh, if you'd like to visit the service, you can just type the URL uh, ereading.nlg.gr. The e-reading service during the implementation, uh, but also during the initial phase of its operation, uh, it was funded exclusively by the Stavros Niarchos Foundation in the context of the NLG relocation uh, project to the new premises here at the SNFCC. It was one of the 50 projects funded by the 5 million SNF donation. The service was officially launched during the 24th Panhellenic Conference of Academic Libraries on the 2nd of November 2018, and the response was uh, impressive and the service went immediately viral. At the end of the two-year pilot operation from 2018 to 2020, after having analyzed the data regarding the use of the service and also taking into, cons into consideration the growing needs of users for remote access services, the reading entered the operational phase, which is now funded uh, by NLD. The changes implemented, in addition to some technological modifications, revolved mainly around the usage policy, uh, the increase of the numbers of fee books collections, as well as the increase in the number of Greek publishers participating in the service. By investing in this uh, innov innovative uh, for the Greek standards service, NLT, in the context of its institutional role, aims not only to promote electronic reading in Greece, but also to familiarize, um, to familiarize its users with the electronic book and the technologies related to it. Also to support the expansion of the Greek language e-book production and therefore strengthen the Greek e-book market. At the same time, NLG responsibly informs and educates the users on copyright issues and the protection of intellectual property by implementing technologies such as the digital rights management. Finally, I would like to emphasize the fact that in the long run, the e-reading room aims to gather and provide access to all, if possible, Greek electronic publishing production and also support the production of more e-books from Greek publishers. Uh, here we can see some uh, uh, statistics regarding the e-reading room so far. Up to this day, there are 2,253 2, titles 
of electronic books available from 13 Greek publishers. Currently, there are 21,255 registered users and they have downloaded 74,677 ebooks in total. What is worth mentioning is that since the beginning of the COVID-19 pandemic, there has been a significant increase uh, in the use of the service. At some point, all ebooks uh, in the collection were on loan. Moreover, after the usage policy change in 2021, there has been a, an even greater increase in downloads because in only one year, the downloads represent almost half the number of the total downloads of the initial three-year phase, which translates into, into a 44% uh, increase on average per year use. The reading room offers the opportunity to browse or search an ever-increasing collection of popular e-books from Greek publishers and consequently borrow and read the e-books in Greek language for free and from any place as long as there is web access. The only requirement is to be authenticated as a registered user of NLT. Uh, this is the new usage policy in comparison to the previous model. Uh, the most significant change was the transition from the single user model to the multi user model. A change that offers more flexibility since each title can be used for more, for more than one user at a time, in contrast to the previous model where one ebook could be used only by one user at a time. Now we can have up to five concurrent users per copy. Also, the initial mode model, we had a certain number of prepaid downloads that could not be exceeded, specifically 36 downloads per title. And as soon as that limit was reached, the title became automatically unavailable. In the new policy, we have adopted the pay per use model. And as you can uh, see, the rest of the features remain the same. Uh, the benefits arising from, the, from this service concern all parties involved, as NLG has created a precedent. The librarians trained on the use of the e-reading can promote the service to their local communities and therefore support the promotion of electronic reading culture. At the same time, they will be able to assist local users familiarize with a book uh, and its technologies and hence facilitate access to a large book collection. For the publishers, the e-reading room can act as a means of promotion, not only for them, uh, but also for the Greek commercial e-book, and, and in that way support the expansion of the e-book market in Greece. In addition, publishers are provided with a tool to monitor the usage of their e-books, and consequently to assess the impact of the service the service has on the e-book market. They can even use it as a research tool for tracking down the categories of books with the biggest impact on the market. In any case, though, through the cooperation for the implementation of the reading, the most important goal achieved was to create a culture of trust between all the stakeholders. Now, the next steps are, of course, the increase of available electronic books collection in the reading platform by introducing new titles from the already included publishers, and also by attracting new publishers to join the service. At this point, it's worth, say, worth saying that uh, we're already in the process of updating the collection, and we have also begun collaborating with uh, a couple of new publishers. Uh, finally, we aim to promote the reading room service even more so that everyone who lives in the country, or speaks Greek, or even wants to learn how to read from anywhere, to read Greek from anywhere around uh, the world, we know that the NLT offers a national service of electronic reading in Greece. Thank you for your attention. And if you have any question, you can co contact us anytime at the e-reading at nlt.cr. Thank you. <laughs>